Welcome back to Business Matters. And now I have the pleasure of welcoming to Business Matters, Bo Browning, Senior Vice President of Education and of Operations, and Joseph Moore, Campus Director and Director of Education for the National Aviation Academy in Concord. Welcome to you both. Thank you, thank you for having thank us. Thank you for having us. Oh, so glad you came. Uh, so tell us all about Na National Aviation Academy, NAA. National Aviation Academy is a federal aviation uh, regulation part 147 certificated airframe aircraft maintenance technician school uh, and our primary focus is training aircraft mechanics that's great that's great how long has NAA been in this area NAA has been in the state of Massachusetts since 1932 so we've had a long history up here of training aircraft technicians we've been, we've been in our current location in Concord and Minuteman Airfield since spring of 2016. Now, prior to that, we were located at Hanscom Air Force Base. And tell me a little bit m about the programs that you offer. We offer, we offer programs that prepare technicians that are gonna become technicians to um, repair aircraft. Mm -hmm. um, uh, fixed problems return to service in three criteria, general airframe and power plant. Our general subjects cover basic uh, topics like introduction to how, what is an aircraft, what is a wing, you know? Mm -hmm. And then we work them through uh, basic physics and math so they can get through the calculations to do uh, formulations. When they move into airframe where they do structure repair and yes. so on, we move them through into power plant where we actually deal with engines from pistons like you have in your car, the turbine and jet engines. Mm -hmm. So it, uh, we run it through a 14 month program and um, we get them there. That's great. That's yeah. great. Yes, There's a lot of training involved. It, it, it is a lot of training. The, mm -hmm. the, the program, as Joe was saying, it's 2,000 hours long. It's 14 months. You know, and all the academics, mm -hmm. all the attendance, it's, it has to be accounted for mm -hmm. in order to get to the licensing process for the, for the FAA examinations. Perfect. Right. And what experience does someone need who is interested in applying for your program? Well, at, at National Aviation Academy, we really don't look for anybody with any particular experience coming in. Mm -hmm. We are a training institution, so we believe anybody that's willing to come in, they want to work hard to achieve a goal, mm -hmm. you know, we can get them through the process and, and they, they can successfully complete the program. That's excellent. That's excellent. So you deal with motivated students. Yes. Well, we, excellent. We, we can take somebody who doesn't, doesn't know how to check the oil in their car and carry them all the way through the AMP program. We've had students right. succeed in our program that have actually told me, wow. I don't even know how to change a spark plug. And this person <laughs> is currently working in the industry. Wow. So, yes. That says a lot about yeah. your program. Hard working, hard working initiative <clears throat> will get them to successfully mm -hmm. to complete the program. Tell me about some of the projects that students would work on in class. <clears throat> You know, so, some of the projects that the students will work on in our general subjects, because we have a general airframe and power plant uh, core matter of subjects. Our general subjects, some of the things they may do is uh, how to identify hardware. You know, in other words, from the head markings. Mm -hmm. uh, how, do, how do they uh, calculate the CG of an aircraft, weight and balance? Uh, on the airframe side, uh, metallic and non-metallic mm -hmm. structural repair. And all from the power plant side, Joe. For our power plant side, we teach them how to time ignition systems to aircraft. We call them magnetos, not distributors like in cars. Mm -hmm. And um, uh, we work them through how an, a turbine engine works, turbine engine theory, how, how the construction is, how it withstands, what it can withstand, inspection criteria, maintenance and repair. We run them through the whole time. I mean, this is so critical. <coughs> the maintenance yeah, of is. aircraft, you're dealing with hundreds of thousands of people's lives. Every this day. is so important, Every so day. important. Every day. Um, tell me about what your students receive when they leave the academy. Our students that successfully complete the program, they'll, they'll, they'll be able to take their FAA examinations mm -hmm. to get their airframe and power plant certificate. Uh, once they have that certificate, they're gonna have many doors, many career opportunities are gonna open up for them in the aviation industry, mm -hmm. but also in parallel industries for, from the, some of the skill sets that we teach there. You know, and also we have an articulation agreement with Middlesex Community College, so they can transfer, when they successfully complete the program, transfer credits to Middlesex Community That's College. That's wonderful. I wasn't aware of that. That's no, great cool. collaboration. Absolutely. Congratulations. Absolutely. That's great. Has that been going on for quite a long time when you were at Hanscom as well? Yes. Excellent. Yes. Excellent. That's great. That's great. So um, 
In terms of someone thinking about their career in aviation maintenance, what kind of um, options, you know, what does the industry demand and look for? The, the industry demands, you know, attention to detail, initiative, and integrity. Mm -hmm. Got to be a professional at all times. You know, thousands of people are flying on those aircraft. Mm -hmm. Our integrity, our attention to detail is what allows that airplane to take off and land safely and get those passengers from point A to point B mm -hmm. in an efficient and safe manner. Yeah. You know, so uh, I would say the number one thing, initiative and integrity. Mm -hmm. Excellent. And cur currently, currently the demand for mechanics is, is pretty high up there, um, forecasted to, to just um, exceed what schools like ours put out right now. So mm -hmm. um, you come through our program, put down a hard work like Bo saying, you will succeed, you will, you will move on and, and be successful in this career. And it's quite an industry to be involved with, that's for yes, sure. Absolutely, yes, absolutely. Yes, it is. Yeah, yeah. 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 Tell me, from your perspective, why is maintenance an interesting part of this industry? You know, fr from my perspective, like we touched on a, a minute ago, you know, thousands of aircraft, thousands of people traveling every day. Mm -hmm. You know, that mechanic is ensuring that aircraft, every system on that aircraft is operating correctly mm -hmm. so that airplane can go from point A to point B and deliver those passengers, mm -hmm. deliver that cargo in a safe and effective mm -hmm. and efficient manner. Mm -hmm. you know, uh, safety is paramount. Attention to detail is paramount. One of, the, one of the things for me is, is the impact we have daily and, and, how, and how anonymous it is. You know, you mm. get on a plane, you take off, you fly to your destination, you don't know what it took to right. get that aircraft to carry you from point A to point B safely. Right. We work in the dark. We're not the pilot with the shiny suits, mm -hmm. you know, that you see walking down the aisle, hey, hey. We're the guys behind the scenes making mm -hmm. it all happen. Mm -hmm. and, and, and we do it every day silently, and we make sure that the American public stays mm -hmm. safe. Mm -hmm. You can't pull over on a cloud and stop when it breaks. <laughs> no, right. you got That's that right. right. That's true. That's true. Right. Joseph, tell me about what kind of career placement <clears throat> services do your um, students um, have the opportunity of availing themselves of? All students that attend National Aviation Academy are lifetime, lifetime career services wow. uh, uh, okay. uh, availability. I mean, if you get a job, you lose a job, you come back to us, we put you in another job. We have three career fairs every year. And we also have uh, companies that come in to recruit outside of those career fair opportunities. So there are lots of opportunities for uh, alumni and a, a, uh, attending students to, to, to interface with the industry. And we start that interface from the very first day of first term. Okay. Those students go to career fairs, even though they've just so started smart. to establish mm -hmm. that network with companies that they're interested mm -hmm. in. So by the okay. time they get to that 14th month, they know the people that they, mm -hmm. they're getting ready to mm -hmm. work for. Yes, mm -hmm. and it's a learning curve how to network and make, continue to make those strong connections. Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. You know, uh, aviation is <coughs> like any other business. It's about the relationships you build, you know, how you carry yourself out there, mm -hmm. and the reputation that, mm -hmm. that, you, that you build for yourself. Mm. Tell me a little bit about once they're out in the field and out in the industry. Mm -hmm. What parts of the country do your um, students find jobs in? Cur currently, we've placed at least one of our graduates in almost every state in the United States. Whoa. And we also have students working internationally in, yeah. in other countries. Uh, we, we have students as far north as Alaska, and we have students working over in Egypt. Uh -huh. So it, it's, it's, it's wide reaching. You know, the opportunities are there, if a person's willing to travel, mm -hmm. you know, there's an opportunity. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That's, that's wonderful to have that breadth definitely see of the world. options. You can yeah. definitely see the world. Yes, you know. excellent. And, and one of the benefits of, of being an aviation mechanic, I myself, you can be a flight mechanic. Wherever the plane goes, you go. Mm-hmm. You know, you really do get to see the world. That's yeah. great, it's, that's it's, great. It's a nice thing. Wonderful. <laughs> Are there other jobs that students can look for once they've received the airframe and the power plant um, certifications? The, the airframe power plant certification that a student receives after successfully completing the program at National Aviation Academy, that, that is for returning aircraft and components mm -hmm. to service. Now, the skill sets that we teach, the knowledge that they learn as they go through the program, 
uh, electrical, hydraulics, pneumatics, uh, NDT, non-destructive testing, composites. Mm -hmm. You know, all of those, all of those things, those skill sets can be transferred into other industries. Mm -hmm. You know, we, we have students working in the power, uh, turbine power generation, windmills. Mm -hmm. you know, we have yes. we have students working at amusement parks on high end roller coasters. Mm -hmm. You know, we even have uh, we've placed graduates into the various space programs that are going on out there right now. Oh wow! So it's Great. the skill sets they learn mm -hmm. here are transferable into a lot of other industries. Great. Um, one last question I wanted to ask is I know you, um, National Aviation Academy has a strong presence in Florida. Yes. And now it has a strong presence in Massachusetts. Yes. Are there other areas that you're focusing on as well? You know, right, right now, these are two key locations. Mm -hmm. We want to build our presence back up here in the state of Massachusetts, and we want to be, become the leading aircraft maintenance technician school in the state of Massachusetts. Mm -hmm. you know, so we're, we're concentrating on building this program up right now. Mm -hmm. And as we build this program up, we want to bring some other training aspects in-house also. Oh, great, yeah. great, wonderful. It's, it's so important to be constantly um, having that um, foresight into the future. Yes and see, seeing where you want to grow your programs. Well, when you, when you look at the industry now, anybody who orders anything from you know, Amazon knows about the whole drone piece. Mm. And then all of those are avenues that we're constantly evaluating to look for opportunities to grow our program as we move forward as an mm -hmm. industry. Yeah. Um, it expands the opportunities for, for our, our graduates, mm -hmm. like Bo was saying, into all these other, mm -hmm. uh, other arenas, and, and um, allows us to present something better uh, uh, for those people coming in. Excellent, excellent. Yeah. I'll look forward to you coming back and telling us more <laughs> about your programs in the next absolutely. year. That'll be wonderful. Uh, absolutely, we pre really appreciate being here. Great. And giving us the opportunity. That's Thank great. You. Well, wish yeah. you much continued success yeah. with both the Florida and the Concord yeah, National Aviation Academy locations. Okay, thank, uh, you, thank, so you. thank you so much. You are most welcome. Yeah.